Feature Engine allows you to create reproducible feature engineering steps and also smooth model deployment. It contains techniques to impute missing data and also to encode categorical variables, to perform discretization of numerical variables, handling of outliers, and variable transformation. Feature Engine also allows you to implement specific feature engineering techniques to selected variable groups. Feature Engine adopts scikit-learn functionality, so it is very easy to learn. And you can specify a sequence of feature engineering techniques within one single scikit-learn pipeline, therefore making it easier to deploy your machine learning models. Feature Engine uses functionality from scikit-learn, pandas and numpy, so it's very easy to learn. And it has its dedicated website. Feature Engine also has a documentations website where you can learn more about the methods and attributes included in each transformer. And finally, there is also a GitHub page where you can find the source code, some examples in Jupyter Notebooks, and also you can fork and make pull requests with suggestions for improvements if you wish to do so. You are more than welcome to do that. Here you can find the links to Feature Engine's dedicated website where you can find more about Feature Engine and the latest releases. You also have the link to Feature Engine documentation in case you want to learn more about its functionality and the link to the GitHub page in case you want to contribute or, look, or have a look at the examples or source code. To install Feature Engine, you can do so by using pip, writing pip install Feature Engine. Make sure you install the library before proceeding with the videos. Feature Engine has several advantages. First, it includes all the feature engineering techniques that you will learn throughout this course. Second, Feature Engine adopts and works like any of the scikit-learn transformers, so it's very easy to learn how to use it. One of the most important advantages is that Feature Engine allows you to implement specific feature engineering techniques to specific subset of features in your dataset. And you can integrate the Feature Engine transformers within the scikit-learn pipeline. Therefore, Feature Engine allows you to design and store a feature engineering pipeline with bespoke procedures for different variable groups. And with this, it helps smooth the deployment of the models if you wish to do so. Feature Engine transformers, just like scikit-learn transformers, contain the methods fit and transform. With the method fit, the transformer will learn the parameters from the train set that we'll need to use to transform the datasets. And with transform, the transformers will transform the datasets with the learned parameters. Every feature engine transformer includes an argument variables where we can pass the list of variables that we wish to transform with that particular feature engineering technique. Therefore, it allows you to implement different techniques to different variable groups. Feature Engine Transformers will store the variables that it needs to modify in one of its attributes, and it will also store the learned parameters that we need to modify each one of the individual variables. At the moment, I'm not aware of many limitations of Feature Engine, but of course I created it, so I might be a bit biased. I'm really looking forward to hear your feedback and your experience of how it was like to use Feature Engine.